So how do you turn on a live location for the iPhone and let's get into it. So if you are new to this channel, subscribe to Foxtech because you don't want to miss the next tutorials. Now, if you want to enable the live sharing of location, you need to open up the find my app of the iPhone and on at the bottom, you can see like different sections. So you can see the location of your other devices, items and people like friends, right? So you can tap on the people section and start sharing your location. So your contacts will appear so you can pick a person from the list to which you want to share and turn on the live location. This is very useful as the other person will be able to see where you happen to be at all times. Obviously, you can turn it off at any moment. So that's pretty simple. And the other person can also share their location back to you. So it depends on how you have it set up, but there are plenty of options. And also, as you are sharing the location, it will ask you whether or not you want to share it for like an indefinite time period or if you only want to share it for one hour or until the end of the day, which are the most common options. Keep in mind that this only works between Apple devices, like between iPhones and iPads, but if you want to share it with someone else, there are some other services. For example, a great alternative is using WhatsApp, where as well, there you have the ability to chat with other people, but also share your live location, which will be updated as you move around the map and world and whatever. And you can share it with any person, not just an iPhone user, since WhatsApp works on multi-platform level. So that's how it works. These are the main common reasons or approaches which uh, I like to use on my devices. So let me know what you think about that below. I would really love to hear. If you like the video, hit the thumbs up and I'll see you in the future tutorials, but only if you stay tuned by subscribing. So do that and I'll catch you later.